Hi, I'm Brian from Herd Replacement Parts and U.S. Building Products. Today I'm going to show you how to change out your Maxim style dual alarm operator for a Herd casement window with an Encore style dual alarm operator. Let's get started. So first of all, you want to make sure the window is open. So crank it out a good amount. And then next, you're safe to remove the crank handle, which should just pull off like that. The next thing you'll want to do is to remove the wood stop that goes over your operator. So to do that, you'll just grab it and rock back and forth nice and gently. And with a little elbow grease, it should come up. Now it could happen that the finishing nails come out before the bottom piece does. In that case, that's fine. You do the same thing and just rock that piece off. And the same on the other side of the operator. The next step is to disconnect the operator's arms from the sash bracket and the track. And to do so, you'll need a flathead screwdriver or a multi-tool in this case. You should just be able to fit it in between the arm and the bracket and then push down and then move that arm out of the way. And then for this one, you do the same thing. Now we have both arms free. Once the operator's arms are free, you can take out the screws holding the operator in on the sill. Once you've removed your screws, you can take the old Maxim operator off and place the new Encore style operator where it was. You can now go ahead and screw the new Encore style operator in. The next step is to attach the new operator's arms to the sash bracket and track. Now to do so, you'll want to line up this hole on the hinged arm with the rivet on the bracket. And once it's there, you should just be able to squeeze it in place. It'll, it'll lock, you'll feel it. And then you'll want to do the same on the track. The track is slightly trickier. You may have to move the window to get it to go, but there you have it. Now it's time to reattach the wooden sill cover. Earlier, the finishing nails came out between the upper piece of the sill and the lower pieces. I've just slid them back in. It's very simple. And then next, you want to just slide this down into position over the operator. Make sure to push it into the channel and there it is, secure. Now it's time to put the operator cover and handle onto the operator itself. You can see that the cover just fits over it and should snap into place and then the handle itself goes on like such. You probably need to tighten the set screw on the handle to make sure it doesn't come off. You can do this again with the multi-tool. But again, if you have a small flathead screwdriver, it will also do the trick. Don't tighten it too tight. And there you have it. On behalf of Herd Replacement Parts and US Building Products, thanks for watching. I hope you've noticed that all of these steps can be done from inside the window. So if you need to change out your operator on a second story window, there's no need to get a ladder. If you have any recommendations for fixes or videos you'd like to see in the future, please comment them below. Thanks again.